let's talk about the Power BI interface and workflow. So when you open up a Power BI desktop file, it'll look something like this. We're going to dive into each of the specific menus and panes and options here as we move through the course. But what's important to pay attention to now is this set of three icons on the left side of the screen. These are your three core views that represent the entire Power BI universe. You've got your report view, your data view, and your relationships view. Now, when we think about the Power BI and broad business intelligence workflow, it actually doesn't really follow this order. We don't start with the report and then move into data, then relationships. We're gonna follow kind of a different process. Instead, we're gonna start with the data view and the query editor. This is where we're gonna connect, shape, and transform that raw data. Once we have our data, we're gonna shift gears into the relationships view. That's where we're gonna actually design our data model and tie those tables together with relationships. And from there, we'll move into the third phase, which is actually designing interactive reports and visualizations, and all that's gonna take place in the reports tab. So we will be bouncing around quite a bit between all of these different views, but generally speaking, this is how things are gonna flow. So let me pull up Power BI. I just wanna give you a very quick preview of how these different views and tabs look and feel. So here we are in Power BI Desktop. As you can see on the left, we've got our three familiar icons, report, data, and relationships. Right now I'm in my report view, which is basically my canvas for creating dashboards. I can drag visualizations and objects. I can access my fields and measures here, but this is where all of the designing takes place. Clicking through to the data tab, this is where you can actually see the tables and the raw data and fields that you're working with. So you can click through to see different previews of your tables. Uh, you can also add your calculated columns and measures using data analysis expressions here as well. And then you've got your relationships view, which is all about the data model. This is where you can see your tables as objects, along with the relationships, the cardinality, the filter flow, everything about your model. And we're going to cover all that in the data modeling 101 section of the course. So there you have it. That's your 10,000 foot view of the Power BI desktop interface and workflow.